If you don't understand the difference between first class, business class, and economy, it's not your fault. The definitions can mean different things in different contexts. So here's my super simplified ranking as someone who has flown well over a million miles, which does lack some nuance, of course, for simplicity's sake. We all know economy, it looks like this. Next on my rough ranking is business class on intra-Europe flights. That's usually just economy with the middle seat blocked, which can catch a lot of people who don't know that's all it is by surprise. You do typically get a better soft product offering though with a meal service and drinks. Next rung up, you have first class in the US, which typically means a larger recliner seat and a better soft product as well, with potentially even better offerings on transcons. Then you have lie flat business class in which you have a seat that will go fully flat. I rank a true lie flat over an angled lie flat, but any lie flat at its core is a luxury over an upright configuration. Let me just establish that. Many airlines don't even offer a class higher than lie flat business now because business these days offers such a strong experience. And on social media, many people you hear calling their flights first class are actually in business, which adds to the confusion. Then at the peak is a five-star 